What's up guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we'll be discussing how to uh, create some space from your Samsung Cloud account or you know, delete some uh, gallery data from your Samsung Cloud because you know, the size restriction is actually 15 GB, which is not enough. And in case you have uh, like gallery data of more than 15 GB or you know, some other content, including uh, your backup and all like more than 15 GB, then your Samsung Cloud would be uh, like fully occupied. And uh, you know, it, it will show you a message that your Samsung Cloud is actually full and you should create some space. So we'll be doing that in this video. So let me set up my devices. I have a Samsung S8 Plus as you know. Um, so let me set up my devices and walk you through how you can do that. So as you can see, this is my Samsung S8 Plus. And uh, let me show you the current situation. Uh, let's go to settings. And now we'll go to clouds and account. And here you click this button, Samsung Cloud. So as you can see, it says storage almost full. Uh, let me zoom into the into the camera. As you can see, it says storage almost full. And the cloud usage down, down there, it says 15 GB or 15 GB used. Uh, if I click on that, you can see the maximum size is actually taken by gallery, which is 13.39 GB. And the rest is actually distributed among other things. Uh, so if you scroll down, you can see the gallery is actually taking 13.39 GB of size. Uh, if you scroll board, then you see the other phone data is like 5, 5 MB, which is not much. The backup of my phone is like taking 3.25 GB. As you can see right here, this is the backup of my phone, which I actually uh, took like, uh, which, which is like an auto automatic backup and goes to Samsung Cloud account. So if we combine the size of uh, the gallery plus as well as the backup, it's actually more than 16 GB. So that's why my storage is actually full. So that, that is why we, you know, we are actually getting this message, storage almost full or it is actually full. So, so actually the culprit is, is the gallery because it's taking like too much size. Uh, you know, if, if, uh, if in case your gallery is also like, you know, more than 15, 15 GB, then your uh, storage will be obviously full because the, the limit is actually 15 GB. So if I click on this gallery button, uh, you can see what all uh, gallery items have been backed up to your Samsung account. Uh, you know, click on uh, view all, then you can see all of your personal content like photos and images and, and videos and all, you know. Uh, and as you can see, it's uh, continuously backing up right now, like 213, 14, 15. It's actually uh, increasing right now. So to fix this problem, what you need to do, you have two things. And before doing uh, both of the things, I'll advise you to actually back up your gallery first to your computer using my previous video that I shared. I'll mention the link of that video in the description box also. Uh, so that you know, you actually have your backup of your gallery in case you lose any of your important pictures. So the first way is actually a little complex. Uh, it is to actually delete all of your content of your gallery, like photos and videos manually. And then uh, you actually sync that deleted content to your Samsung Cloud, which will also delete the, uh, all, all those images from the Samsung Cloud account so that you know size actually goes back to zero. But the second way is actually really simple, which is to actually click on this button down there. It says delete all gallery data in the cloud. So if you click on that, you see that the phone actually tells you that all of your photos and videos will be permanently deleted from Samsung Cloud, which is what we want to actually create some space. The gallery data on your phone will not be uh, deleted at all. So that means only the content which is on your Samsung Cloud will be, will be deleted, but nothing will be deleted from your phone. And also third point also tells you that, that if you uh, proceed further, your automatic sync will be turned off, which you can actually ma manually turn on again later on in the, in the process. So let's do this. Uh, I'm going to delete my all of my uh, data of gallery from my Samsung account. So just click on this button, delete and turn off sync. And uh, you need to actually enter your password. So let me do it. Okay, so now since I have uh, added my password, just click on the confirm button. And it says all of your gallery data has been deleted from Samsung Cloud. So let's go back and verify that. Gallery, it says uh, the sync is off, zero bytes used, trash is also uh, empty. So if we go back to the Samsung Cloud account, we see that our cloud usage have significantly uh, been freed. It says only 10% have been used, like 90% of the data has been deleted. The gallery has been completely cleared. The Samsung notes are still there and also other data as well as my uh, previous backup, you know, 3.25 GB is still there too. So that means my gallery has been uh, completely wiped off from my Samsung Cloud account. And that's how I actually gain 90% of the space. So if in case you actually want to um, further back up your phone to your Samsung account, you can actually go back to your gallery and uh, click on the sync button, like, like sync on, and it will start syncing your data on your Wi-Fi. 
And to further actually prove this, that my uh, content is actually still there. So if I go to my gallery, you can see my images are still there in my phone. However, the content from uh, Samsung Cloud, the, the gallery content from Samsung Cloud have been wiped off. So that's how I gained like 90% of the space. And if I go to like gallery settings, you can see that Cloud Trash is also deleted. Well, this is pretty much it from this video and I hope you can actually uh, free up some space from your Samsung Cloud account using this tutorial. I hope you liked this video and it was useful for you. And if it was, do give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because I'll be creating more cool videos like this every week. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video.